After studying this module, you should be able to know about the metal cluster compounds, preparative methods for metal cluster compounds containing single and multiple metal-metal bonds, type of bonding and molecular orbital picture of the metal-metal bonds in such clusters. Let's introduce about these. Metal-metal multiple bonding is an important feature of the chemistry of many transition elements and is very important to the field of metal cluster chemistry. They constitute an important class of multiple bonds unlike multiple bonds between the main group elements and the multiple metal ligand bonds. Multiple metal metal bonds are of the order of 2, 2.5, 3, 3.5 and 4 are well known. The rehenium rehenium double bond was the first ever observation of a metal metal multiple bond in Re3 C12 with 3 minus charge. A typical property of metals is that rather than forming straight chains or rings, metals tend to agglomerate so as to form maximum number of bonds with minimum number of adjacent metal atoms giving rise to either metal metal multiple bond or metal cluster compounds. Metals do so to attain 18 electronic configuration and hence to attain stability. For example, the triangular cluster of dideca-carbonyl triosmium can be viewed as a stable trimer of the unsaturated 16 electron fragment of tetracarbonyl osmium. The 15 electron tricarbonyl rhodium fragment forms the tetramer of dideca-carbonyl tetra-rhodium with a tetrahedron of metal atoms. Such kind of compounds may be classified as organometallic clusters. Unsaturated or electron deficient metal fragments may form multiple bonds with other fragments such as RO3 molybdenum forming a triple bond with molybdenum RO3 and molybdenum 6 mu3 Cl whole 8 with 4 minus charge are referred to as inorganic clusters. Organometallic clusters are often low oxidation species and require ligands such as carbonyl, whereas inorganic clusters are often higher valent and have ligands such as chloride. Thus, the term clusters can be applied to a broad class of compounds which include metal-metal, single or metal multiple bonds as shown here. Preparation of organometallic carbonyl clusters. Metal halides, oxides and other compounds react with carbon monoxide gas in the presence of a reducing agent which can also be the excess of carbon monoxide gas at high pressure. The process is called reductive carbonylation. Yields are often very poor. Let's explain with these reactions. CO, O2, C, Me hold twice with four water molecules when, reaction, when react with carbon monoxide gas in the and hydrogen in the ratio of 4 is to 1 at a pressure of 200 bar at a temperature of 430 degree Kelvin in an acetic anhydride medium gives you CO2 with 8 molecules of carbon monoxide, carbonyls. RuCl3 with X water molecules plus carbon monoxide at a temperature of 400 degree Kelvin at a pressure of 50 bar in methanol gives you Ru3CO whole 12. OSO4 plus the carbon monoxide gas at a temperature of 400 degree Kelvin at a pressure of less than or equal to 200 bar in methanol gives OS3 CO whole 12. Diiron nonacarbonyl with a formula 
Fe2CO9 is usually prepared by photolysis of FeCO5. Two molecules of FeCO5 on photolysis give you Fe2CO9 plus carbon monoxide. Metal carbonyl clusters consisting of four or more metal atoms are prepared by a variety of methods such as carbonylation and pyrolysis. For example, CO2, RH, mu, Cl, whole twice, RH, CO2 in presence of carbon monoxide gas at pressure of 1 bar at a temperature of 298 Kelvin in hexane, hexane and sodium bicarbonate gives you RH4 CO whole 12. Similarly, Na3 IR Cl6 in reacts with carbon monoxide at a pressure of 1 bar in methanol under reflex gives you IR4 CO whole 12. Similarly, ET4 N whole twice and IR6 CO whole 15 will give you IR6 CO 16. OS3 CO12 at a temperature of 483 degree Kelvin gives you OS5 CO16 along with that OS6 CO18 and OS7 CO21 and OS8 CO23 is also formed. In this reaction the OS6 CO18 is a major product and can be separated by chromatography. Preparation of inorganic metal clusters. Chromium 2 carboxylates exist as dimer with general formula as you can see here and represents a class of compounds containing metal metal multiple bond. It is prepared by the addition of an aqueous solution of chromium Cl2 to an aqueous saturated solution of NaMeCO2. Here Cl2 in the aqueous solution along with NaMeCO2 again aqueous will give you Cr2H2O whole twice mu O2 CME whole 4. These type of chromium dimers possess chromium chromium quadruple bond. Tungsten dimeric clusters can be synthesized by electrolytic reduction of tungsten oxide in concentrated hydrochloric acid. As you can see in this reaction WO3 with concentrated hydrochloric acid when is brought about the electrolytic reduction will give you W2Cl9 with 3 minus charge. The W2Cl9 with 3 minus charge ion is diamagnetic and possesses a tungsten triple bond tungsten with bond distance of 242 picometers. Oxidation of W2Cl9 with 3 minus charge ion produces W2 Cl9 2 minus ion which is a lower bond order of 2.4 and increased bond length of 254 picometer. The reaction is the two molecules of W2 Cl9 with 3 minus charge with chlorine will give you two molecules of W2 Cl9 now with 2 minus charge and the two chloride ions. Refluxing an acetic acid solution of molybdenum hexacarbonyl would result in the dimolybdenum tetraacetate intermediate which is a useful synthon for a variety of other molybdenum cluster variants. Replacement of acetate with chloride ions using a solution of KCl in hydrochloric acid would give rise to the dimolybdenum octachloride cluster. As you can see in this reaction, MO with 6 molecules of carbonyl will give you MO2 mu O2 CME whole 4 in the presence of Me CO2H when further reacted with KCl in HCl will give you MO2 Cl8 4 minus. 
the mo2 cl8 4 minus ion possesses a metal metal quadruple bond with a bond distance of 214 picometer and a bond order of 4.0 the oxidation state of molybdenum in this complex is plus 2 the trirrhenium nona chloride cluster complex can be easily synthesized by heating rhenium pentachloride so the reaction will be recl5 on heating will give you re3cl9 interestingly the trirrhenium cluster has a triangular structure with three rhenium ions forming a triangle where each rhenium ion is connected to other by double bond with a bond distance of 245 picometers as you can see it here. The interesting dirhenium octachloride cluster with the formula Re2 Cl8 with 2 minus R charge can be synthesized by the reduction of Re4 with minus 1 and 9 using hydrogen gas or HPO2 with 2 minus charge in the presence of HCl. The product possesses a rhenium rhenium quadruple bond with a bond distance of 224 picometers. The reaction will be Re4 2 minus in presence of hydrogen or HP HPO2 with 2 minus in the presence of HCl will give you Re2 Cl8 with 2 minus charge on it. The structure and bonding of metal metal multiple bond containing clusters. The chromium based dinuclear clusters containing metal metal multiple bond has the general formula as shown here. The chromium ions share a quadruple bond. Sometimes the ipsocarbon is coordinated with ligands such as water and pyridine. As you can see here, now in this structure, the chromium chromium bond is 197 picometers and the chromium chromium bond length in the other example is 237 picometer. The chromium chromium bond length is normally 197 picometers. Whereas this bond distance increases to 237 picometer with ipso substitution of water and pyridyl ligand due to elongation of the chromium chromium bond. In the absence of ipso substitution that is in the absence of the axial ligand the chromium cluster associates to form a two dimensional structure you can see here. The chromium 2 ion is diamagnetic in these structures where the d electrons beam involved in the quadruple bonding. The chromium atoms can be defined to lie on the z axis and out of the its 9 atomic orbitals each chromium atom uses 4 orbitals which are s orbital px py and dx square minus y square to form chromium oxygen bond. The px and dz square orbitals mix together to give two hybrid orbitals directed along the z axis that is px dz square bonding and px dz square non bonding. This bonding or orbital overlaps to form a sigma bond whereas the dx dx and the dy d, dyz overlaps to degenerate a pair of pi orbitals and finally the overlapping of dxy orbital leads to a delta bond. The degree of overlapping is in the order of sigma is greater than pi is greater than delta as you can see here. The face on dxy or dy z x square minus y square will give rise to a delta bond. Side on dx, dxz and dyz will give you a pi bond and end on pz, dz square will give you sigma bond. The 
quadruple bond formation in the dimolybdenum and the dirhenium clusters can also explain on the basis of similar molecular orbital explanations. Let's summarize what we have studied that cluster compounds contain metal-metal single or multiple bonds and form rings or linear chains. Apart from containing sigma and pi bonds, cluster complexes also display delta bonds. Cluster complexes can be synthesized by various methods such as pyrolysis of carbonyl clusters, nucleophilic attack on clusters, reductive elimination and attack of metal precursors on multiple bond containing clusters. Cluster compounds can be divided into two types namely the organometallic clusters containing the metal metal single bonds and the inorganic metal clusters containing the metal metal multiple bonds. Inorganic clusters may contain quadruple bonds due to the formation of an extra bond called delta bond which is formed by the overlapping of the dx square minus y square or dxy orbitals. The degree of overlapping and hence the bond strength is in of the order of sigma is greater than pi is greater than delta.